This is the Fuelmatic. It's made by Green Fuels. It's 5,000 gallons a day of biodiesel processing. As we know, there are three things that are involved in biodiesel. The oil, the methanol, and the methylate. The oil comes in here. Comes into the system. goes through a filter. goes into this preheating tank. The preheating tank heats the biodiesel up to about 140 degrees Fahrenheit. Recirculates it around to, to maintain that temperature. The methanol, the methanol and the methylate come into the system here. And oil, oil comes from the tank into this tank. Then we measure in the methanol and the methylate into this tank. 500 liters. It recirculates for a period of time. You can see during the recirculation, you can see what it looks like now. And when we're done, you'll see what it looks like <coughs> after we're done recirculating. So it does this tank first, recirculates it, and then it does this tank and recirculates that. Same thing. This tank. Just, just in uh, two stages. I was right now is all three. This has the, this has the oil, the methanol, and methylene recirculating right now. And this is part of our ability. Now, when you make biodiesel, the oil is a triglyceride. It's a glycerin molecule. It has three long hydrocarbon chains on it. What the catalyst does is it comes and it cuts off those three chains. It separates them into three states from the glycerin. The methanols come and they plug on to the end. And the glycerin is heavy, so it falls in the lighter fluid down to the bottom. And that's what this, that's what this machine does, this part here, is a glycerin separator. And it's, it's a number of flat trays, horizontal trays. The, the biodiesel with the methanol and the methylate is mixed, goes into the top with the glycerin. The glycerin comes out the bottom. There's a conductivity gauge. This glycerin is conductive and biodiesel is not so much. So we can we can separate the glycerin out. The glycerin goes to the tank over there. So uh, the glycerin is now out of the process. The next step now is the biodiesel. When, when, we, when we actually put the catalyst in with the, with the oil, some little percentage of water down the catalyst and made soap out of it, which is dissolved into the biodiesel. So we have to take the soap back out of the biodiesel because the soap is bad for the engines. So we go over to the other side.
Good, I think. Yeah. Yeah. I just great, great system when I was talking about safety, <laughs> I was talking about CE rating and explosion proof. And all the instruments on this machine are CE rated and explosion proof. And you'll see as you walk around the machine and look, it's very important. So after the glycerin is separated from the biodiesel, the glycerin goes into the glycerin tank and the biodiesel goes into this tank. Now this tank, again, has a heater on it and we are evaporating methanol off the top. Three places in the system actually we were uh, evaporating methanol off the system. And it, I'll show over here, well let's come around this way. Yeah, I mean, it's a device. 